You're watching CES Live, powered by Ustream.tv, the most powerful way to stream live video, and by NewTek, makers of the TriCaster family of broadcast and streaming systems. And now, CES Live. Hey guys, welcome to CES Live. I'm Callie Lewis. I am Kevin Mitchelluk. And this is CES Live at CES 2014. We've already had two days full of live streaming coverage. Are you exhausted yet, Callie? I am. I mean, my voice is actually getting better now that I'm live. Good. I don't I know what's going good. on you're there. You're pulling it together. <laughs> Keeping it together between like, the beacons. You can, good. you can see the, uh, as we move through the cameras, you'll be able to see the show floor behind us. It's really exciting. Lots going on here. And uh, we also have something very exciting. I know you're extremely excited. Yeah, I'm like, how did I get lined up with this segment? I'm I wondering. don't know. I wonder how. We've got Alex from Blackberry. Thanks for joining us. Thank you. Alex Kins yeah. Kinslaw, not Kinsella, Kinslaw, right? Kinslaw, yeah, and a silent it's, E. Silent it's spelled e. Kinsella, but it's Kinslaw. It's like confusing. coleslaw, but Kinslaw. Yeah, you know what? People have gone years with it. Did you so. have any coleslaw for lunch? Uh, no, I haven't even really? eaten lunch yet. Really, Kevin? Just, you this went is, there? This I'm is sorry. CES. You don't eat at CES. You just you have just a coffee and you go. go. That is true. You just move. How so. is CES for you? It has been it's been awesome. This is the first time I've actually gotten to the show floor oh. yet. And uh, so I've, I saw some stuff, lots of, a lot of robots. They had window cleaning robots. <laughs> window cleaning robots. We've got them on later. It's scary. I yes. like robots. I don't. I also, well, like, I also oh. like Blackberry and that's BBM. Yeah, BBM. Yes. We've been here the whole week uh, doing a lot of meetings, a lot of interviews. It's been pretty positive. Um, and we were at New Media Expo right before this, so we've actually been here for seven days, oh, uh, which is a little bit more than we need. But yeah. <laughs> of Vegas. Yeah. So, okay, so we've, we've got Blackberry and BBM. Yeah. Let's go over the recent developments okay. um, about, so just so everybody is on the same page about what's going on with you guys. Yeah, so uh, we, we're still here. Uh, so I know <laughs> I got that question a lot. Um, I did, but we're still here, we're, we're still moving. We did uh, a little bit of a reorg. We have a new CEO named John Chen, yeah. uh, who's a pretty amazing guy, put a plan together uh, that I think everyone is really, really gonna like. Um, and part of that is, is making BlackBerry into four operating units. Right, so we have our devices, which we're known for and everyone loves, and it's fantastic. We have Enterprise, which is you know our bread and butter and our, our core thing. Uh, QNX embedded systems, and they're actually here on the show floor. Oh, okay. And they got some wicked new cars out to show. And then uh, my favorite part is messaging. Yeah. So uh, BBM, um, uh, now we brought it to iPhone and Android uh, last October. We're seeing really great traction with that. And we've got an update coming out uh, in the next few weeks called BBM 2.0. Some really awesome new features. And uh, we're hoping to, uh, to get more people on. I have to say, so when I first met Kevin here, <laughs> um, obviously he is the host, or he is the um, editor in chief of uh, Crackberry.com. I love blackberries a lot. You love blackberries, and he, I, I, I wouldn't say you love blackberries. I mean, you're like over the moon about blackberries, and specifically about BlackBerry Messenger. So I was very intrigued to you know use it and test it and everything. Um, and so I, I'm so glad that you guys ported it over to all the different platforms. And I, I honestly haven't had quite the chance to uh, play with it as much as I, I would like to. I had a little bit of trouble setting it up, but it was like the first day. Um, and so I, I want to see how it all, you know, is working and hear yeah. more. Well, you know, and it was the number one ask we had from our customers. Yeah. Right? They, you know, people on BlackBerry and they have BBM. They're like, you know, I have some friends and they've gone over to iPhone or Android. We want to chat with them. Right, they love BBM and we want to get them on, and so we, we listen and we answer with that. Um, and so BBM 2.0 has got, I actually have an iPhone and a BlackBerry. I'm now one of the people who carries two phones. It's very, <laughs> very strange. I'm coming over You're with coming the roving VisiWig camera. Okay. Can you get in there, there all right? There we go. And you'll see uh, people chatting with me, which is always going to be really funny when I use my personal device for demos. <laughs> so just ignore that. Um, so I have BBM here on two different phones, um, here on the iPhone 5C and on the BlackBerry Z30. Um, and yeah, I said Z, I know. <laughs> Canadian. So we got a couple really cool things. So you know, one of the reasons you're going to use BBM uh, over anything else is you want to use it because your friends are on it. And how do we get friends on it, right? So we're looking at ways of making you know, really cool new features that you would want to use. So one of the really cool things is called Quick Share. So in Quick Share, if I go into a chat here, so I'm going to chat with myself. I talk to myself a lot. Can you do it with yeah, the, okay. I'm gonna, yeah, yeah, there we go. So with Quick Share, I'm able to share voice notes, photos, live, what I'm doing. I, I have, uh, I can share calendar attachments and contact info, other photos. I can integrate into my Dropbox, so I can send any file that I have in Dropbox to a BBM contact. 
But one of the really cool things, especially here at CES, is you know I was in the back of the hall here and I'm on my way up. I'm able to quickly just send a timed glimpse of my location. So we oh. partnered with Glimpse, and so I can send this. We've used Glimpse quite yeah. a bit. Yeah, and so it'll send it over here. I didn't here. know you did that. That's, That's awesome. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so I'll be able to click here and then view the glimpse. So instead then, of broadcasting your location yeah, to everybody so, in the world, which is a little bit scary. Yeah. So again, BBM is about the idea that I've invited you to connect with me, right? It's not just I'm giving out my phone number or you know the service is spamming my address book and inviting all my contacts, which no one really likes, right? This is, I, we're trusted contacts. I just want to share my location with you at this given moment. So it's right. so one of the really cool things we're, we're excited about. It's going to be on BlackBerry, iPhone, and Android on uh, the next few weeks. Very cool. Yeah. What then, are you, oh, sorry. Go ahead. Oh, no, go ahead. I was just going to ask Kevin what your favorite feature is. I'm a big fan of something that's been rolled out recently, but not yet to iOS and Android uh, channels, BBM channels, yeah. which is sort of like a new, I don't know, I don't, what's the best way to describe it? What's uh, the elevator pitch on uh, channels? You know the elevator pitches? I actually do that, the social media explain with donuts. So you ever seen that floating around? No. So it's, right. it's, somebody drove it on a marker board and it was like, Twitter is, Twitter is I'm eating a donut. Right. And Instagram is, here's a vintage photo of me eating a donut. LinkedIn is my skills, including eating a donut. Snapchat is, I'm doing inappropriate things, things with, with a donut. donut right? yeah. I mean, Google Plus is, I'm a Google employee you, eating a donut. Right? <laughs> right. So what what is BBM? Well, BBM is, let's go get a donut. Right? It's about this immediate call to action. Right. So if I BBM you, you know it's, it's something we're going to go, we're going to meet up somewhere, right. we're going to do something, you have a question you need an answer from, right? When I set my out of office when I travel, I say, you know, I'll get back to your email when I get back to the office, but if you need something, BBM me, and that's the trust yeah. in that. With channels, it's the same way, where now brands and businesses and artists and blogs and everything you can think of, they can be on BBM as well. So you still keep your, you know, personal BBM contacts personal, you have your chats, but now if there's a, you know, if I'm really, like I love Mobile Nations, I can follow Mobile Nations on, on channels, right. I can follow Crackberry on channels. When I get an update from them, it comes in the same way a BBM would. Right, so I'm reading it in that same, you know, quick way. I'm engaging with it, and we really think, you know, we've we've seen really awesome engagement levels. I know you've seen right. some great ones. You have a couple yeah, channels. Absolutely, my favorite channel is uh, Hot Guys in Yoga Shorts, yeah. which is just pictures of me trying, attempting to do yoga really poorly in, in yeah. yoga shorts. It's a very yeah. popular channel. Yeah, it's really good. It's it's. Mm -hmm. Okay, and so, um, what else do we have over here? Let's look at some real channels. Yes, let's look at some real channels yeah, as I go back it's here. It's true, I'm not lying. So, I, I have a question about channels, actually. Yeah. Um, so, where, you know, in terms of when people talk about their social media followers, you yeah. know, I have this many followers. Uh, is channel something that, that, that you see being able to work itself into those numbers and those figures? It, yeah, it does. I mean, it's it, the same as you say, I have this many likes on my page or this many mm -hmm. followers on Twitter. You have um, subscribers on BBM channels, right? One of the things we're trying to differentiate with that is, so if, if I wanted you know, to add you on BBM, I'd say to you, like, hey, add me on BBM. And I'd share my pin and we, okay. we'd become BBM contacts. Brands and businesses on channels do the same thing. So it's not follow us on, on Twitter and it's right. not like us on Facebook. It is add us on BBM, right? It's the same personal level, but now with you know a larger business or yeah. a brand. Yeah. Yeah, I'd like to see that to be be some be one of those, you know, Twitter, Google Plus, Facebook, yeah. BBM. Yeah, and actually there's a number, sorry, there's a number of brands that have actually started. So we're, we're Channels is launched on BlackBerry, it's coming to iPhone and Android in the next few weeks. Um, so there's a number of brands who are now putting that on their site. So they'll have their Facebook icon and their Twitter icon, and now the, nice. the Channels icon. It's one, of the, one of the things I really like about Channels is the escalation. So, you know, if you think about Twitter or that, it's, it's very much you're talking to a very big audience. And, you, get, you know, you can start talking a little bit directly, but then it's like direct messaging, or you're talking to somebody, but it's still public. Okay. And with BBM Channels, you can actually set yourself to be open and have open chats. So, you know, I have my Crackberry Kevin channel, there's 8,000 followers, and every now and then I'll say, yeah, I'm available to chat. And okay. all of a sudden, you know, people who find that, they'll just start talking to me one-to-one, -one, very private. And it's a really cool feature, a really yeah. good way to sort of escalate to the next level of commitment. Yeah. So even here, like I took a photo earlier when you guys were on with a guy from New Tech. And it's a new tech video toaster guy, right? Uh, like, well, yeah. He used so to, yeah. He used to be to video toaster. Oh, yeah, I'm, Absolutely. I'm a video toaster fanatic. Uh -huh. So is, so is Dave Curley over here. <laughs> That's where I got my start in life. There you right? go. Yeah. So here, like, I'm just gonna do a quick post, and I'm just I gotta do this because I type, and I know I type. Wait, I, I get approval, right? Yeah. <laughs> Apparently not. Oh, he's typing fast. Typing quick. Look at that. Like we only have two minutes left, so we gotta go. Okay. Yeah. All right, we're doing it. Beautiful. Yeah, so I'll post that now. 
And one of the cool things thing? is, you know, as a channel owner, you'll see immediately how many people have read your message yeah. out of your followers, so you know your instantaneous oh, reach nice. on it. Yeah. So as the owner, I get to see the reads and the likes and the oh, likes and comments anyone else can Very see. Very cool. Yeah. Well, that that I think gives people who haven't been familiar with BBM a little bit of a better uh, explanation of what they can do with it, which is really exciting, you know, because you guys are, are making some changes. I, I know that uh, Kevin, you have. Something else you want to share? Well, I've got my fancy Real new quick. Porsche design phone, which, you know, I want to know how soon will I be able to make voice and video calls through BBM yes. to iPhone and Android owners? So that would actually be the next, so BBM 2.0, you'll have uh, voice available for iPhone and Android, and video will be in a release coming up after that. Okay, perfect. Yeah. So that's coming up soon. Yeah, very, very, very soon. So BBM, it's Look really going from a BlackBerry only yeah. thing to uh, all things to everyone. Yeah. I know in the chat room people are asking, when is Windows Phone going to get it? Because it's BBM for all but them right now. Yeah, you know what? We, we get asked that. I mean, you know, even uh, on, on some other platforms too. Like the, the main group of customers that ask for BBM were iPhone and Android users. So you yeah. know, once there's a, a you know a critical mass and Windows Phone users asking. Yeah. You know, we're, we're equal opportunity. We want to connect everybody on Absolutely. BBM, right? So if, if there's a good number of users on Windows Phone, then we'll, we'll get there. Excellent. Well, I'm going to give it a try more than I have so far. I will convert to you. I, <laughs> I, I will be following Kevin's hot men in yoga pants. There's like 93 other people in there. I'm hot not, guys in yoga shorts. I, I I'll show you after. I'll show you between <laughs> segments. <laughs> Curly's in. in. Dave Curly's in. I it's don't all know. good. All right. Well, Appreciate thank <laughs> thank you so much yeah, for joining for us me. and giving us yeah. a little bit of insight. That's great. No thank you. All right. You guys. Uh, be sure to stick around for the rest of the day. We're reading the chat room as you just heard Kevin talk, talk to you guys. Uh, so um, any, any of ours slash CES Live will be back for more CES Live. I'm Callie. I'm Kevin. Bye.